Okay, hello everybody. It's a city Matt Haven here today, and uh, I was on Discord this morning, and I noticed that World of Tanks is doing their yearly news for the 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 the, 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 the what's it called the bat battle journey. Yeah, your best moments of 2021. I actually wanted to share this with you guys, and uh, do it. So I actually had to include desktop audio for once. Sweet. I'm actually a little bit excited about this. I think I gotta log in. I don't think I'm logged in. Maybe I am. Okay. Am I logged in? No, I gotta log in. There we go. Now we're logged in. Yeah. Start your journey. I'm actually, um, <clears throat> I am a little bit worried about this because Cold War came out. And whenever Cold War came out, we had all the Cold War tanks come in. So for the best match of the year, I'm kind of hoping it's not Cold War. Because for me, I would rather see like what I did in World War II rather than what I did in Cold War. In all honesty. Seven thousand matches played. Russia, that's two years in a row. I like how they're showing off the double barrels. Your best three battles. Okay, hold on. All right, you destroyed eight vehicles, caused 4,268 damage, assisted 1,500 in the Senlac. Okay, I'm actually not surprised the Senlac is popping up on this. Because during this time, the Senlac was absolutely broken. I remember doing a video on that. Um, because you're able to get the DPM. <clears throat> okay, I'm, I'm happy the Sinlax actually on this list because that tank is amazing. And then the Kree events, two vehicles, 4,417 damage, and uh, what is assisted? 2,710? 2,700? And the Kree events, one base XP, 2,386, but the Sinlax with uh, 2,432. So the, the, the Kree events would actually be my best. Because of the uh, 23. You know what? I'm going to double check something real quick. Alright. The thing I decided to check was to see if I had that replay. Of the uh, Kree of Vets. <clears throat> Sadly I don't. Because it's on the 11th. Well it's on the 14th. And uh, um, my dates only go back to the 18th. Of all the replays that I have. Because I like to clean up my replays and keep everything fresh. So I, I'm I'm a little bit sad. I wish I would have kept that one. Pretty sure I had it too. Uh, but if you notice, yeah, the Senlac. This was during the um, <clears throat> recording session that I had inside the tank. So yeah, we had it, they were both in the 16th on the same day. So yeah. Still though, that's actually awesome. I like how they have three battles rather than just one. Okay, so uh, battle roll report. Vehicle type. Ooh, I like how they have the vehicle type. So you have lights, battles fought in 2020 with. Uh, so I didn't really play. <coughs> I have artillery on the list. <coughs> I'm dying. <coughs> Sorry for all those artillery players. But. Oh. I'm actually, I really do like how they have this setup, though. And then Tank Destroyers, I've, I've played a little bit. And then the victory rate, um, you guys can see that I'm very dominant inside my mediums with the amount of matches I've played with my uh, 59.6. Actually, if you take a look, oh, I like that because I go 2020 and then 2021. So they're comparing it from, are they comparing it from the last year as well? <clears throat> so they're showing off your... 2020 and your 2021 okay so light tanks win rate stayed the same my mediums went up by a whole percent point two and then my heavies they just jumped through the roof and then tank destroyers they jumped up by three percent almost that that's actually in an artillery yeah uh, whatever Dude, i'm i really like how they have the battle report set up for this year
Let's actually bump up the audio a little bit. Your lucky man is where you win the most battles. Elberon? Didn't they just barely bring this back? Your most played vehicles. Okay, Sinlac with 192 battles. Um, I did play the Sinlac a crap ton because I bought the Sinlac because uh, I had Becky Lynch prior and I wanted the unskinned variant. So yeah, with the unskinned variant, I put 192 battles in that tank this year. Sinlac's a great tank, you guys. If you don't have it, even though you can't get the DPM that I had before, it's still a fantastic tank. Kriya Uh This is... This is one of my tanks that I just, I, I don't feel like you can really beat it too much as a tier 8. Because it's just a really good all-rounder. You got 195 turret armor, but it's at an extreme angle. I just realized that my surround sound was turned up too loud and you guys could hear my volume from that. And then from the end game. So, you know, I'm just, I'm up it. I'm just a Muppet. IS-7, though, um, since I have uh, three-marked it, I have been actually using this tank specifically for testing and trying out new builds. Don't get me wrong. You can't use just one tank to test out builds just because it, it there's only so many characteristics you can change in a single tank. So using the IS-7 as like the only example is horrible. It's why I have the E5, the E75, a couple others, a couple tank destroyers I do it to as well. Like I'm just trying to learn as much as I can with it. And yeah, just uh, uh, add a sticker and share. I like that. I can share this. I'm not. I'm not worried about sharing it. I'm. I'm here sharing it with you guys. I'll be able to come back to this later and laugh at myself by my monologuing that was just horrible. Back to Heather. Readjust all the audio. Your total and average base XP. Okay, so 6.6 .6 million. That's an average of 933 base XP per battle. That's it. That's not bad. It's a lot of XP though. Okay, damage caused 17 million. Oh my god. I'm sorry, you guys. I don't have a life. Look, I, I'm afraid to ask Vishaw if he can share this one with me. Kind of want to see Vishaw, so that would be nasty. But 17,400,000 and then 5.2 million assisted and 6.4 blocks. Is this my lifetime or is this my year? Sixty-four thousand. No one, no one can call you a one-hit wonder. Seventy-nine percent accuracy, eighty percent penetrations. And keep in mind, I don't fire premium all the time either. This, like, I there's there's some tanks I only shoot standards out of. So, this is all about knowing weak spots by this point and just having really good positioning. Twelve thousand seven hundred. <laughs> Your most destroyed vehicles. Okay. I don't feel bad about this. Okay. The 268 version 5. Of, of course, when I see those things on the field, I'm going to kill you. The E4, since they buffed it, and I now know how to kill it consistently, I'm going to kill you. That is my goal, because apparently no one else knows how to shoot you. By the way, you load heat rounds, and you shoot it in the gun mantle now. Okay, just shoot it left or right of the main gun mantle. That's not spaced armor. That's just physical armor. You'll go right through it every single time. Dragon, I actually wasn't expecting this. Most destroyed vehicles this year. That's actually really cool that they added that. E4s though? Yeah, no, I'm gonna shoot you. 
268 version 5s. It, it, it was extremely popular for a while. Okay, what is this? Number of vehicles destroyed 10,500. Next time, we need something destroyed. We'll give you a call. I like how cheesy they have this. Vehicles. Vehicles set a light 101. And the vehicles were turned into a still bonfire. <laughs> so, so out of the 7,000 matches I played and the 17 million damage I did this year, I've, I've only set 101 people on fire. And I, I remember having a match I did it three times in that single game. Ram destructions. Enemies were destroyed by you ramming into them. 322. I am proud of that number. I am proud of that number. It's all about the ram. Your nemesis <laughs> times it destroyed you 110. Damage received from it 289,000. You better keep an eye out for it in the future battles. Well, too bad it's my number one most destroyed tank. <laughs> they did a really good job on this one this year. I like this. Oh, okay. Yeah, Escalation Air, Armored Cold. I don't care about Cold War. I'm sorry if you guys like Cold War. I'm not a big fan of it. Okay, Seasons Completed. Am I surprised that I've completed every single season that they've done? And I'm going to complete every single season um, from now on as well. So, yeah. Uh, dude, honestly, they did a really good job on the battle uh, journey this year. For 2021. And I wonder if they uh, compared it to uh, last year's. Okay. Oh. Get rewards. Uh, congrats, Commander. This year is epic. Enjoy these rewards for your efforts in 2021. So one day a premium. Uh, my Xbox is actually loading right now. I literally just got home and I, I read this while I was at work. And I was like, oh, that's going to be so cool. I'm excited to get home and share this with you guys and you know rather than watching it once and then sharing it with you guys i wanted to bring you in with me just not knowing so like literally i'm just trying to get everything set up as quick as i can and yeah just as, as you guys can see i struggled with it a little bit am i still recording i am okay um i got i gotta go back okay i don't can i skip can i jump ahead total battles fought 7,122. Most played nation. Three best battles. So Russia, battle report roll. What was the battle report roll? Okay, so this one, I'm actually kind of wondering if this is from last year's and then they're comparing it to how much you've improved. I think that's what this one is. Battle roll. Right, yeah, battle roll report. I think this is uh, from last year's efficiency rule that they showed off which means that total battles fought they should have done a comparison to what your previous year was so i played a thousand more matches this is they did a really good they took a lot of time on this to make it the way i really like the way they did this this is a lot of effort that they put in not gonna lie that's a lot of effort um but other than that, you guys, that was my battle report for the year. That's really cool. 7,000 battles played. I played 7,000 matches. Okay, and while looking at this, I'm actually kind of wondering. Okay, so my lifetime damage, actual damage, is 48 million 787,000. So that means that this year alone, I brought that up from 31 million to 48 million. So yeah, dude, this year, you guys, I've put in a lot of work playing this game, enjoying it, to bring you guys as much information as I can. I, you know what? I'm not even sad about this. Dude, you guys, check out your battle reports. Let me know in the comments how many matches you guys played this year. 
Um, let me know what your favorite tank is. Who's your nemesis? You guys get the 268 version 5 as your nemesis? Just let me know. Because apparently I kill them and they kill me. So it's a mutual relationship. Okay? It's, it's mutual. Other than that, you guys have a fantastic day, night, afternoon, whatever time it is for you, wherever you are. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to... I'm gonna get back to it. I'm gonna go put in another 7,000 battles this year. And probably uh, try and upload more uh, than what I actually do. Which really isn't a whole lot. <laughs> Just kidding, I do a lot. You guys have a good day. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. And seriously, let me know how many matches you guys played this year. Um, if you outdid me, let me know. Because you outdid me. You need to stop playing. Because I played a lot this year. Scratch that. Vishaw's probably got like 11,000 battles this year. Yeah, let's go ask him. Let's go bug the crap out of Vishaw's channel. Yeah. Holy crap. I'm sorry. I'm surprised. That's a lot of my life. Woo!